All right, so I've seen a couple of posts lately asking about how much horsepower am I making with this 60 to 130 time, or does anybody know how to guess how much power am I making based on my time? So I went ahead and took some data that I was able to find on the Draggy Talk Facebook group, as well as uh, dragtimes.com 60 to 130 times, and I found posts made by people that listed their weight and their wheel horsepower. And so of course this data is only as good as the data that people provided, but I went ahead and plotted all those points. That's what these green dots are. And so once I did that, I was able to create a formula of a, a line of best fit. And so once I put in all this data, came up with the line of best fit, we're able to come up with a calculation to be able to tell us what our wheel horsepower is based on our 60 to 130 time and the weight of our vehicle. So the formula is your 60 to 130 time to the power of negative 1.09 times 1.126 times weight. So as a test, we can come over here and uh, I've got two examples from my own personal experience. One is my truck. It ran a zero to, or excuse me, a 60 to 130 time of 7.13 seconds. And so if I take my 7.13 and I take it to the power of, so that's this X to the Y, take it to the power of 1.009 and then press this plus minus button here to make it negative and then click the multiply multiply that by 1.126 and then multiply again and take it times the weight of the vehicle when i made that test which was 5500 pounds and it comes out to 853 horsepower and when i made that run i was making a around 830 wheel, 830 to 835 wheel, corrected to SAE standard. So the weather was a little bit better that night, and so it would make sense that it's a little bit higher. This is just a general calculation. There's so many variables that can change this, and obviously you guys can see right here that the dots don't fall directly on. There's several above and several below. This is just the line of best fit. So for this to be within you know, 15 to 20 horsepower of that is, is pretty good. So as another test, I had um, uh, a car run a 12.9. Uh, so if we take that 12.9 and we again take that to the power of 1.009, multiply that by 1.126 and then multiply that by the weight of the vehicle at 4200 pounds and that gives us you know 358 horsepower so again just a general rough guesstimate way too many variables to get any closer than that but using data that you guys have provided and that i was able to find this can get you close.